Hello folks, what's up, Lewis going on? Welcome back to another video. We are back from our Christmas break. We had a lovely Christmas. Ate too much, drank a wee bit much. Played some games, but today, I am tidying up from Christmas. So we did clean up yesterday. Matthew is cracking on, taking this plywood and I guess drywall out. So the plan today is to hopefully get this wall all ripped out and then move on to the hallway. So let's crack on with the day. All eyes on the way I vibe when I walk into the room. Wind blows underneath the soles of my brand new parachute. Yes, that was a full on guess. What are you talking about? Oh. Why, why can't I know them? Would you like to repeat the question? <laughs> I said, hey, Ma. How, first of all, how quickly did I get the answer? <laughs> like, instantaneous. I didn't think you would. Oh, Jesus Christ. I said, hear that. Panama disease kills what crop? And I said... <laughs> How did you know? I said... Bananas. And what's, the, and what's the right answer? Bananas. Okay, then. I was it a guess? I didn't think you'd know it. The, it was, Panama disease destroys what crop? The answer, the, the choices were beetroot, bananas, strawberry or peas. I didn't want to help you out. So I didn't you didn't even give me an M. You just asked me what it was and I told you what it was. How did you know that? Because I'm not, I know these things. Why? You don't grow bananas. You don't kill bananas. I'm in the secret Where did you learn that? I'm in the secret society for knowing this sort Jesus of stuff. Christ. If I tell you, I'll have to kill you. Why would you burst out laughing? Just Cause because it, just, it was instantaneous. And I honestly didn't think you'd get it. It was a question I didn't think you'd get. We're, we're figuring out questions for a quiz with you. Oh, no. A quarter? A fifth divided by a tenth. You've worked in inches for seven years. No, I haven't. You I've have? I've worked in the weird lines. I don't know, what is it? Two. Obviously. <laughs> it is. Obviously. Hey, Kirsty. Hey, Matt. Eight members of the Crow family. We just f did this. I know, you wrote it down. Uh... The Rook, The Raven, Hooded, J. Carrion. Magpie. It's not how you spell it. It's not how you say it. <laughs> Chuff! Chuff! <laughs> <laughs> And they added a new one in, which we figured out today, which is Jackdaw. And you wrote that down five minutes ago, and you're still struggling. Matt, it's been 13 <laughs> years of me struggling with this question every three months. What car make is associated with the va va voom slogan? I see you, baby! Shake it out ass! You shake it out ass! It's also that make as well. I see you, baby! A master. No. Get out of here. Um, va va voom. Yeah, that ugly car, innit? <laughs> I mean, I had one. Fiat. I, I had one. Not, I had a Fiat. Not a Fiat. Um, no, the other one. Uh, Renault. Yeah.
she's open. We had a, a little mishap. We got a little crack. Just a little crack. And one over there, but it's easily fixed. It's open. It's all that matters. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. You can't see it that badly. And like, turn my dryers on. You can hear it anyway because we've never had a door there. No, we'll soundproof that half wall at least. Yeah. But again, I do the normally I do the washing dry when you're not around anyway, or like on a Sunday when we're not doing it. We've made a little bit of progress. That was open up. We still need to cut this down, but we are going to call it a day for now. It's still Christmas, so we don't want to be running ragged too much. That one was a bit of a challenge with it being on the stairs. Yeah, so. We made a bit of a mess. We made a bit of a mess, but we'll call it a day. It's Boxing Day, so. And I guess. Yeah, I don't know if you can even pick it up on camera, but the, the dryer is running. So some concern to some people was that, obviously, with a wash and dryer, then you'd hear it. The washer's going to be obviously louder, but the dryer is actually... Oh, look at the bin! The dryer's quieter than the ice machine. Yeah, the ice machine's way louder. But I think we've also become accustomed because we've had it like that for four years. Don't stand there, it's dusty. And you're quite close to that saw. It. It's like having a child, a moody teenager. Somebody growled because I tried to get him off the bed this morning. I mean, he was fast asleep. You woke him up, told him to move. He didn't get. He wasn't able to stretch. He got snappy. He got snappy, like a moody teenager. Like someone else we know. Yeah, I feel sorry for my parents now. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yes. We'll call it a day. We'll clean up, and we'll see you whenever we see you next. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye now. Can't remember what day we're on. All the days have started to merge. Sorry, sorry. No, but I don't remember what day. Like day six, seven. I can't even remember. But today's plan, now that we've got this open, we are going to take down the hallway and then we need to move everything out to demo properly, but today's plan, hallway. This is my 